that Losi would make an RC motorcycle, but look at what they just announced, the Promoto MX. And in today's video, we're gonna do a speed test. Go, 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 go. But first, Hit Crew Nate's gonna tell you a little bit about this. This is one of the most insane releases by Losi ever. This thing is redesigned from the ground up a thousand percent. So anything you've ever known by RC Motorcycles, completely forget it and throw it out the window because they have done justice to this. This does have a gyro. It's a brushless outrunner motor with a flywheel on it. It is gonna be balanced so perfectly that it has three driving modes, on street, off road, and wheelie mode. It is chain driven, just like the real deal. And check out the spokes on those tires. No RC motorcycle has ever been able to do that. Also, we've got a real functioning disc brake on the front of the bike. The lean bars can come off. They can also be adjusted to go up or out more if you need more assistance or less. And I've been told this is almost impossible to actually sit down to where you can't get it back up and drive it without having to go recover it. Now you guys know me, I love flying RC planes and this is where we fly a ton of them. This motorcycle has airplane technology in it, something called AS3X and SAFE, which helps to stabilize your bike rider. You can turn these assisted modes up or down, on or off in those different driving modes and we are gonna have a blast with this motorcycle. Today's video is all about the speed. We wanna see how fast this motorcycle goes with way more content planned in the future for our channel. So if you're not already subscribed, be sure to subscribe. Oh, I just noticed the wheel. <laughs> How did I just notice that? That's awesome. The spokes look amazing. They're not like that on the other ones? No. And this <laughs> is a different radio in a sense that there are a couple different things like the flywheel. And this is such a unique startup process. I want to show you guys everything. Now this operates on a 2S 5000 milliamp with an IC5 plug. These are pretty affordable batteries. Let's do the startup sequence because this is amazing. And I've not done this yet. So I'm You've going to experience. Told it's amazing. I've been told it's amazing. I'm really hyped about this. <laughs> the battery tray drops out here. Amazingly, this whole brick fits right under the seat. Really clean and flush. The wire sticks out through this little gap here. Plugs in under the driver. That's amazing. This is just, it's all hidden. They did such a good job. Radio on. We do have telemetry on this radio and the power button is hidden behind the driver's shin. We have to give it five seconds to calibrate, just like our airplanes. We should have, yep, steering. And now the flywheel kicks on and we give it 30 seconds to spool up. Sounds amazing. Thirty seconds, guys. It's awesome. <laughs> Sounds like it's the same frequency to me now, so we're good to go. Abby, I want you to pick this up and try to move it around. They'll try to like twist it and stuff. Oh wow, well, that <laughs> it probably doesn't look like I'm doing anything, but it's. <laughs> It's, it's fighting. <laughs> like, okay, I'm gonna push it left. And it's like really pushing back. Isn't that so cool? Like that, all that. Okay. Oh my God. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. This also has a starting block, racing or whatever. You can set it up on that starting block. And it comes with nails. We show a lot of this in an unboxing Wait. video that we did. But Abby, you can literally start the bike without it standing up. And I think we should do that. Ease onto the throttle. There you go. He's up. So we're just gonna give it a quick little drive here just to make sure Abby's got a feel for it, right? Wow, this is way different than any other motorcycle <laughs> I've ever driven, which is only one. We are zeroed out. Just 100 throttle limit? You can do whatever you want. We'll do lower, we'll do 50, and then I'll just go right to 100. Okay, okay, Abby is starting off in 50% speed mode because we always do this on our ground vehicles. And also it's in on street mode, which is like most assisted. Is that full throttle on 50? Throttle. Okay, that's 50%, so that's fine. If I had to guess before I knew what I actually know, I would say top speed, I'd guess like 25 miles an hour, but I, I kind of already know what to expect. Although for this speed, that's gotta be at least 20 miles an hour. We'll bring him in and see how fast he's going. This is after all a speed test video. 
Abby, you're doing good driving a motorcycle for your very first time ever. We're looking at 25 miles an hour. Now, again, that's in 50% speed mode. So we're just going right up to 100 now. Right out of the grass. The grass is going to be no problem on this. Let us know your guesses in the comments. Try to be truthful about it and tell us before you actually watch, watch. it. Yeah, don't watch. Guess Pause the video watch. and guess. Here we go. Ooh, nice. So what'll happen in this driving mode, if you pop up, it'll actually control the bike and force that wheel down. That's all right, Abby. It takes practice to get used to the turns. That's okay. Look at you. It's not bad. <laughs> it is actually amazing. And what you don't want to do is... a minute for him to slow down. Mike. That's okay. You don't want to actually hit the brake on the turn because that Ooh, disc brake will actually... Down. You got it. That was actually a sharper turn. Yeah, this will be good. Okay. Nice, Abby. That's awesome. So just slow it down for the curve is all you're saying. Yeah, look how sharp... You're getting the hang of it. That's oh. so much sharper of a turn. One more. And then Go for it, yeah. Yeah, I haven't even... <laughs> I haven't even driven it yet. What do you think of this though? It's pretty cool. Super tiny learning curve, but not not bit, bad not at bad. all. Not like our previous motorcycle experiences. This is amazing. All right, I'm just gonna try it because I feel like everybody wants to see it. Off-roading in the this grass? This is really tall grass, you guys. Oh yeah. This is like half throttle. No problem. Quarter throttle. No problem. I'm gonna try to catch it. Catching. No, okay, there you catching go. And stopping. Here we go. That's perfect though. You are 42 miles an hour. Right. That's amazing. That's amazing. That's good. Motorcycle, I just cannot believe that. Nate. Yeah. I like Mr. Martin. Don't hurt him. I'll buy my own. <laughs> there you go. For those that are curious, because my wife was curious, you can unzip and undress the little rubber <laughs> rider. And they will sell aftermarket different clothes for him and collar modifications for your bike so you can race with other guys. Then yes, if you want to, the driver can come off of there. This guy is made out of a very flexible rubber. It's a learning curve. There you go. Yeah, nothing. That's nothing. Okay, I'm just starting right at 100. Turns, I'm at zero throttle for that turn and yeah. it is pretty sharp. So Abby, you just got to ease off the juice completely on the turn. That's about what Well, I'm you got to slow go. it down too. Oh, he is cruising right along. So yeah, slow it down, hit the brakes, then turn. That's it right there. He takes a minute to slow down though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so cool. Yeah, I love that. All right, go, 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 go. Okay, so I want to see how fast I went, but before we end this video, Abby, I want you to try <laughs> Thank you. the other mode. You I've know been what dying. Doing, right? <laughs> yeah, I saw it kick up there on me and I was ready to do it. Oh my gosh, this is so awesome. Nate got, well, he's the same as me, so 42. 42. Let's we'll say Nate you. went 41. I win. <laughs> There's so many cool things to talk about on this motorcycle, one of which is the hidden skid bar. So if you're popping wheelies and riding them a lot and you're falling back farther than you should this will pull up and you've got the skid plate back there to protect your bike and the body here's how easy it is to change the modes you just use this little rocker we can go dirt mode or wheelie mode three i think is wheelie mode so it's back again thanks you got to drive it for five seconds <laughs> ready yes there you go oh that was cool that was a good wheelie so you can drive it regularly not even in wheelie mode and then when you're ready to pop up, you just throttle punch, front wheel comes up. There it is. Nice. Nice. <laughs> and that's why that skid plate's on the back. Good recovery. Just takes a little practice. And probably, guys, I would say this 15 mile an hour winds that you're hearing, Definitely. gusting up to 20, is probably affecting the it's wheelies. It's going this way better. With the wind. Yep. Look at that. That's cool, Abby. Oh, it's so cool. Look at you go. Uh, <laughs> and in case you're curious, this is not a fragile motorcycle. We fully prepared to, we're prepared to get air. Just want to start off with our speed test. Oh, that's awesome. You want to try? I do. We're going to have to do Willy Mania on a day that's not so windy, I think. Oh, you're getting better at it. Okay, I got to give it a shot. Here, pass it while it's running. Oh, okay. Here. <laughs> Well, that's impressive. Previous motorcycle we've had, we would never have been able to do this. You can pop a wheelie on it. 
It was chain driven, but that's the only thing it had. Okay, All right, so Nate's usually the winner when we do wheelies, wheelie manias, but we'll do a separate video. But he's usually better. <laughs> okay, so there's definitely like some skill there. It has the wheelie mode, but I think the wind is really, really It effective. definitely is. It's very gusty. Man, this is cool though. I don't want to put the controls down. <laughs> and that tells you you got a winner. <laughs> I just, I could, I could, I want to get air. This is amazing, but. You can try grass? grass. That's all right. No, not wheelies in the grass, but maybe it can. Do it. Do well, it. Get in there. Okay, let's do it. See if it'll do it. Pop it. Oh, oh yeah, nice, nice, I think it does nice. it better in the grass. Nice. Nice, nice. Yeah, I think I won. <laughs> oh, that was awesome. This is an entire different experience when it comes to driving RC cars or ground vehicles in general. I've never experienced anything like this. And we've been on YouTube for 10 years. So in 10 years of driving, I've never seen anything like this. Okay, Nate, you say I need to do the- Flywheel. So just turn it off, yep. yeah? And just so you know, we probably drove, I know YouTube editing is different, but probably about 10 minutes at least. or so, and I'm at half battery. So turn the flywheel off. Now when you do this, it takes 30 seconds because there's a brake. And you guys, we did an unboxing video. You're hearing that brake. That's cool. You want me to wait? <laughs> sure. It does sound cool. It takes 30 seconds or so for that brake to apply for the flywheel, which you guys are hearing. Sounds like a jet engine turning off. And if you were to just power off the bike or it lose power from the battery, let's say you unplugged it, it would take about five minutes for that flywheel to stop spinning. Our lean bars got chewed up a little bit, but that's to be expected on this. And that might be a part that you're gonna have to continually invest in if you want it to look good and nice and clean all the time. But this is insane. If you wanna see a more detailed video of this, we have on our other channel, the RC Sailors Extra, our unboxing and initial reaction impression. So be sure to check out that video. It'll be linked down in the description box below and at the end of this video on the end screen. Now this was just our first time running this with the speed test and a little bit of wheelie mania happening, just a little bit, but we'll have more. Make sure you subscribe, make sure your notification bell is turned on because we're gonna off-road this and ramp it. This is supposed to be insane on ramps. I checked out the promotional video and it's crazy. So you guys are gonna wanna make sure you stay tuned for that. So I will have this linked in the description box below for you to check out. Clicking that link doesn't cost you any more, but it does help support our channel and our family. And it helps us continue to provide free content like this here on YouTube for you guys so you can make informed buying decisions. And through our links, there are two different versions. You have the one we have and you can buy your own batteries. And there's a completely ready to run version where you don't have to think about anything. It comes with the battery, the charger, the radio, everything. Makes it very easy and it's only 50 more bucks. We'll have both linked down there. But there's actually three different colors that you can choose from. And like Nate said, there's gonna be different clothes or at least one outfit you can buy for him and different front plates so you and your friends can race this because you better believe this would be awesome to race. I can see a whole new world of RC happening because of what Losi has done right here. And as I said, this, our battery, everything you've seen in this video will be linked down in the description box below. Well, for an awesome first run, I want to thank God. This is just so cool to be a part of such a groundbreaking RC. And for that, I am so thankful to him. I also want to say a huge thanks to our RC patron family members. You guys are the backbone to our channel. And if you want some RC Sailor stickers for yourself, because they would look pretty good right here, we got to add one ourselves. You can get those by signing up at Patreon. As I said, I'll have our unboxing over on the RC Sailors Extra channel popping up right about now for you guys to check out. We'll see you guys over there. Bye!